for Eyewitness News begins with breaking news. We begin here at noon with breaking news. Crews are trying to put out a fire at a home on Bent Road in Windsor. Thanks so much for joining us. I'm Caitlin Francis. That call came in around 1030 this morning. Pinpoint News Tracker shows us exactly where this is taking place right off of Prospect Hill Road. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Cassidy Williams is on the scene live with more. Cassidy, what's going on right now? Caitlin, we were asked to stay back here near Prospect Road and the intersection of Bent Road as firefighters work to put out this fire. The good news is it appears to now be under control. We just saw one fire truck leave the scene. When we got here about an hour ago, we were asked to step back as the fire kicked back up. Police officers were asking everyone in the area to get back. We talked to a neighbor who was out on her morning walk when she saw all of the smoke coming out of the home. She described how neighbors, police, and firefighters work together to try and save the man inside. So my husband and another neighbor, they were able to get a ladder up to the back of the house. And there was a, a gentleman in the window trying to get out. You know, he was trying to get air. And then the police came and the police were, they were swallowing some serious smoke. It was bad. They were taking turns at the top of the ladder, holding the guy out the window and trying to move him. And then the fire department came and they were inside and, and then I was asked to move to the front so I don't know after that but they did take him away in an ambulance so hopefully the quick reactions of all of our all of our fire department and policemen are, are going to help. We have not had an opportunity yet to speak to first responders at the scene as they have been busy working this fire. So we do not have any information from officials about that man's conditions. As soon as we have an opportunity to talk to them and get an update about that man and if anyone else was home at the time, we'll provide updates both on air and on the Channel 3 app. Reporting in Windsor, Cassidy Williams, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.